I've been using Notebook LM's AI and creating some insanely realistic looking video podcasts. In fact, here's a preview of one so you can see just how good they look. Have you ever wished you could just like download knowledge straight into your brain? Oh, totally. Well, Google's been working on something that might be the next best thing. Really? It's AI that turns any information into a podcast. Whoa, like a robot reading the news. Kind of, but way more advanced. That is super cool. What's it called? It's called Notebook LM. Everything you just saw was made in less than one hour fully with AI. The realistic voices were created for free inside Notebook LM. Then the people that spoke those words were created inside a separate AI tool. And finally, an AI tool did any editing that was needed to finish things off. Actually finding real people to have podcast conversations, filming it, and then editing it all yourself takes a ton of time. Trust me. So today you're going to learn how to skip all of that by using Notebook LM and other AI tools. Great. So we need to start by creating the voices for our podcast conversation. And we're going to do that inside Notebook LM, which we'll see on screen right now. If you scroll down, you'll see that it has this listen and learn on the go feature that we can use to create deep dive discussions with one click. That's what we need to use right now to create the voices for our podcast. And later, we'll create the video side of things. Notebook LM seriously creates the most realistic voices that I've seen any AI tool create. And I can't believe it's free. So when you start a new project inside Notebook LM, you need to point the tool to the information that you want the podcast conversation to be based on. We can see down here that we can point Notebook LM to a website or a YouTube video, or even upload our own PDFs that we want the podcast conversation to be based on. For this example, I'll keep things simple and I'll just copy some text directly into Notebook LM. So I'll click this button here to do that. Conveniently, I found this Wired article that talks about how you can use Notebook LM to create a podcast, pretty relevant. So I'm just going to copy the text from this article and paste it into Notebook LM. So now that's pasted in, I just press this insert button here. And after just a couple of seconds, we can see from this summary that Notebook LM has processed and completely understood what was in that text that I pasted into it. So now the information that we want our podcast conversation to be based on has been added to Notebook LM, we just need to have it generate the vocal conversation for us. And to do that, we just go over to this area here, the deep dive conversation and press generate. And that's just going to take a minute or two. And by the end of it, we'll have a fully fleshed out podcast conversation, usually around 10 minutes in length. And once that's finished, we'll have the audio side of our video podcast created. You can see it here, it created an 11 minutes and 51 second long conversation for me. And I can press play to hear what that sounds like. Have you ever wished you could just like download knowledge straight into your brain? Oh, totally. Well, Google's been working on something that might be the next best thing. I find it so great that you can find any information off the internet, paste it into Notebook LM for free, and within a couple of minutes, have a fully fleshed out podcast conversation between a man and a woman that sounds scarily realistic. This is nuts. So now we have the spoken audio for our podcast. We can download the audio file by just pressing this download button here. But we've only got an audio file at this point. You're probably wondering, how do we create the video side of our video podcast? Let's jump into that now. To create the realistic video footage for our new video podcast, we're going to use this tool here, Synthesia. There's a link in the description to get set up for free. And as you'll see on the website here, Synthesia is an AI video generator that specializes in creating AI avatars. And seriously, Synthesia creates the most realistic AI avatars of any tool out there that I've seen. So we're going to have Notebook LM creating that realistic audio for us and then a realistic avatar tool synthesia creating the video side of our podcast for us i'll show you how to do that now so when we're inside a new project in synthesia we need to start by adding the character to our project that we want to say the words so to do that we're going to click this avatar button up top here that's the word for the digital character we're going to create and you can see at the top here they have some really realistic characters in some natural settings that we can choose but i've actually found if we scroll down it's the ones further down that look even more realistic so these characters here with this purple diamond next to them these are 
Synthesia's like cutting edge, most realistic digital avatars that they've created today. If we scroll past these, there's some options that don't have that purple diamond next to it. They just kind of have this like white hand or sorry, this white diamond. We want the ones with the purple diamond. These are the most realistic characters I've found. So we're going to create the male character first. We're going to select Ali. And for now, we're just going to create the male person in our podcast. So we're going to focus on Ali right now and we'll create the female presenter after. So to make Ali actually say those words that Notebook LM created for him, we just need to upload an audio file of him talking so that Synthesia can do that for us. So to do that, we just press upload right here and then select the audio file of him speaking to upload to Synthesia. But you might remember that that one audio file we downloaded from Notebook LM contains both the man and the woman speaking. But we just need to upload the man speaking to get Ali to speak the male parts. So we need to find a way to split apart the male and the female parts of that audio file and save them as two separate files so that you can upload only the male voice to Synthesia when you're creating Ali's video in it. And then later, only upload the female voice to Synthesia when you're creating your female character. So how do we split those two voices out from this single Notebook LM downloaded audio file? Well, luckily, there's a ton of AI tools out there that can automatically split apart different voices from a single audio file and save them out as new files. I've been using this tool that you're seeing now on screen, Spectra Layers 11, as it has this unmix multiple voices feature, where you can see here, it's let me split that Notebook LM audio file into its two separate voices. So I'd recommend using Spectra Layers 11 for this, but there's other tools out there if you prefer. So now I've split out the male voice and the female voice into two separate audio files. I can simply choose to upload the male parts of the audio to Synthesia to make our male character speak. So let's do that now by opening this. And oh, we'll see here, look, we've got this warning message. The audio must be a maximum of five minutes long. So this is the last problem I had to figure out in this process, and it's all smooth sailing from here in creating those realistic video podcasts. You just need to split both your male and your female audio files now into five minute long chunks so that you can finish this process of creating your podcast characters. So split your male and female audio files down into those five minute chunks using any editing software that you normally use. It's really easy. I did it in Adobe Premiere because that's what I always use, but use whatever software you're familiar with. I've also quickly added a background to the video of my character by just pressing media and searching for an image of a white office here and selecting this one. And now I've split the 11 minute audio file of this male character speaking. If we open up that folder, we'll see that I now have male voice one, male voice two, and male voice three. So that's been split into three parts. So I just need to come back to Synthesia quickly before I upload any audio and duplicate this scene three times as I have three audio files I need to upload. And now I can upload those three audio files one by one to each of those scenes and generate the video of my male podcast character speaking. So let's do that now. So I'm over in scene one. I just simply need to upload the first file of my male character speaking. While that's uploading, I just need to select the language as well, English. Once that's done and you can see it's uploaded, move to the next scene. Now I need to upload the second audio file into scene two of my male character speaking. So we'll do that now. And once you've continued the process and uploaded all of your audio files to each of your duplicated scenes, like I've just done now, you simply go up here to generate the video of your character speaking. So we're gonna press generate and then generate the video by pressing this button. While that's generating, simply repeat the process for your female character by using the female audio. And you'll see a screen like this showing you that both the male and the female videos are generating independently in Synthesia. Once that's finished loading, you can watch it back and see just how realistic they look. They're both finished now. So let's just watch a little bit of this female speaker talking to just see how realistic this AI avatar looks. So we'll click into here and check this out. Whoa, like a robot reading the news. Awesome. And now we can simply download the separate video footage of our male podcast guest and our female guest so that we have a separate video for each person, just like we would in real life. To do that, we just press this button here and download the video using this link here.
Like I said, the characters that you get from Synthesia create the most realistic looking podcast guests that you can get from any AI tool out there. The link to Synthesia is in the description to this video, by the way. And just like that, we've created the realistic voices and the realistic video footage for our video podcast. And it blows my mind that we can just find any topic on the internet quickly that we want a podcast episode about and use this process to make a podcast episode. The only thing left to do now to create our finished video podcast is to merge that separate video of our male podcast guest and female podcast guest together into one single edit of a podcast episode. I do the editing all automatically too using another AI tool called Descript. It does all the podcast editing stuff that you need automatically so you can just churn out these realistic podcast video episodes and just make a ton of new content this year using descript is really simple and self-explanatory for editing podcast episodes but if you want a step-by-step -step tutorial or you want your handheld watch this video next because that's one i've made on all of descript's podcast editing features to get you to your finished podcast episode so watch that next and i'll see you on the next one